flexibility is the name of the game when it comes to social life. Sometimes you don't have the luxury of using your phone when you know you need it. Other times, especially in relationships, you don't want to respond right away, but you also don't want to leave loose ends. In countless situations that life throws at you, message scheduling comes as a bit of a relief. While scheduling can come in many forms, including Telegram bots, the Google Messages app is one of the more elegant solutions. Here's how you can schedule text messages on Android with the help of Google Messages. Google Messages is the default SMS app on most Android phones, but if your phone doesn't come with it, you can easily install it from the Play Store. If it's not the default SMS app, it will prompt you to replace your default SMS MMS messaging app. Create a new message for someone by tapping on Start Chat. Now, instead of simply tapping on the Send Error icon, hold your finger on the icon until a scheduling menu pops up. Because this feature is brand new, you may actually see an additional option to make the SMS urgent. But if you see a scheduling menu instead, you're one of the lucky ones that have been granted this new feature. You can either set it for one of the three set times during the day, later today, 8am, 1pm, 6pm, whatever, or pick the precise time and date with the bottom option, pick date and time. Once you've selected the schedule for your message, tap on save. This will show the selected time and date above the text of the message with a tiny clock appearing on the send arrow icon. This will work on all types of messages for as long as the phone is connected to either a mobile network or Wi-Fi during the time it's sent. And don't forget to switch to dark mode by tapping on the upper right three dot icon and then tapping on enable dark mode. This will not only prolong your battery charge, but will be easy on the eyes when messaging in low light environments. So yes, as an advanced replacement for your default SMS app, Google Messages is pretty impressive. Once you start using it, you'll wonder why the default SMS apps are so primitive. Better yet, it continues to be updated almost every month and you can do all kinds of things like reactions to already sent messages. You can actually edit photos before you send them, adding text on it like you can with TikTok. And also by holding the microphone icon, you can record and send voice chats similar to what you can on WhatsApp. So, as you can see, you're missing out on a lot of improvements to the standard, basic, boring SMS service if you don't upgrade. Speaking of messages and considering Facebook's latest massive data breach, you may want to also take a look at alternatives for Facebook Messenger. Links in the description. Okay, as always, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for your support. But that's it for now. I'll see you next time.